Okay, I got a 2010 Mitsubishi Outlander. I'm going to replace the <coughs> the struts. Uh, this one doesn't have shocks. This one got struts. So to remove the the bolts on the top. <coughs> You have to remove that cover right there and you need to lift it up this area right here so the bolts are right there there is one the one is um, right there so the other side is this one and, and right there and they are number 14 so I'm going to remove those and I'm just going to um, loose the bolts. So you're gonna lose the other side too, so now but don't remove the don't remove the nuts yet. So you're gonna remove it later. Okay, so as you can see I got the car on the lift and I hold it with this uh, hoist. I'm using a 17 in this side and a 17 on the other side to hold the bolt. So we are going to remove this nut right here with the 17. So now we're gonna remove and with the hammer we're gonna hit it right here on the on the bolt. Okay. So we're gonna get down good and going to remove Okay, so so we hold it seventeen. <coughs> so also we need to remove the tire. Okay. <coughs> We're gonna do the same thing in this side. So I'm going to remove the tire uh, with the 20, just 21, I think. Yeah, with the 21 uh, socket. Okay, so now we can remove the nuts. Okay. 
Okay, this one. Let's remove the other one. So you gotta remove the two bolts, nuts there. We're going down. And we're going to play a little bit. So now, okay, with the help of a pry bar, I'm gonna stick it there. Just be careful, don't, don't touch any wire, okay? So I wanna stick it right here on the nut, okay? Now we're gonna pull down, okay? And then I'm going to pull down to release the salt on the top. As you can see now it's out. There you go. And now you can just take it out. There you go. So uh, on my case, I had to replace the spring uh, to the new one. Oops. So I had to replace the spring and the uh, uh, strap mount to the new one. <coughs> but uh, it's better for you guys to get the complete assembly. It's easier and you don't have to like you know, remove the spring and do the, like extra work. So just uh, buy the complete assembly. It's like uh, thirty-five dollars more for the complete assembly. So, <clears throat> so you're gonna do the same thing. So when you install the new one, um, just uh, this is the old one. So just. Let's stick it here, okay? Just let's pretend that this one is the new one. <clears throat> and with a pry bar, you stick it here. I just try to you know, get it inside there. <coughs> so you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. So it's uh, really easy to do, uh, but if you have help, it's better. You know? So remember, we got uh, two 14s, a nut on the top, a 17, and that's it, guys. So you're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Okay, if you got any questions, just let me know. Oh, one more thing, I'm sorry, guys. To pull the, the bulb here and here, you have to do the same thing. You have to do the same thing. Um, you're gonna carry it from here, and you're going to try to put the bolt through here. Okay. Same thing. All right. All right, guys. Thank you. And now I'll see you next time.